I have something completely cool and different. This is Dr. Constantine Frank, Dry Riesling from Finger Lakes, New York. Finger Lakes, New York. <laughs> that just sounds funny to me. Anyways, uh, this is the 2020, running year around $20, 12% alcohol. And guys, have you ever had Riesling from Finger Lakes, New York? I stop saying that, Finger Lakes. Um, they are very similar to the German Riesling and even Alsace. Sauce. Am I saying that right? <laughs> it's a little late, sorry. <laughs> so I haven't had this in a while and I found it in my wine, my refrigerator and I was like, you know what? Damn it. Let's try this guy. Um, if you guys like dry Rieslings like I do, they're fantastic with seafood. I mean, you just can't go wrong with these. And no, they're not sweet, guys. That's what dry Riesling means. So when you're looking for Riesling, always look for a dry Riesling especially from Finger Lakes, or if you can find it from, of course, Alsace is a little bit cheaper than you're gonna get it from Germany, because Germany gets really expensive, like $25 up to sometimes, you know, hundreds, especially if they're aged. And the age racing is a whole different ball game. All right, beautiful color. Wow, very salty, very minerally, minerally. <laughs> the morality, minerality is amazing on that right now, the smell. Definitely getting some lemons, some limes. God, it's so salty. Oh my God, I'm like totally salivating because that's, the acidity in these wines are really high. So that's a good thing, not a bad thing because you want that, especially when you're having some kind of like shrimp dishes, spicy food, like a Thai, Thai dish would be amazing with this. Um, my goodness, Chinese food. Oh, okay, I gotta taste that. I get a little apple there too. All right. That's lovely. For $20, lovely. You could fool me with, you could fool your friends with this one and tell them it's 30, 40 bucks, they'll believe you. Because it's that delicious. Wow. And I've had it out of the cooler for a while now. I'd say a good hour. And it's tasting lovely, at, almost at room temperature. So a good white wine will do that to you. Like it will just taste so beautiful when it has to be that chilled. You know, so rule of thumb, guys. As long as you don't need the expensive wines to be too cold. I mean, I don't like them like that. A cheaper wine, definitely cool. Throw in some ice cubes. I mean, I don't care. Throw it in the blender or some ice cubes. Make a slush. Make a slushy out of it. <laughs> Almost a <said> slush puppy. <laughs> That's awesome. So 80s. Gotta love it. All right, guys. So remember to like, subscribe. I'm Tony Del Sol, and I'll see you guys soon. Salute.